Right guys, so today we're reviewing a set of mission darts from the latest launch. It's a Connor Scott B2 24 gram steel zip. Uh, I like the coating on this. So without waiting for the guys, let's check out the packaging, check out the darts and have a few throws at the board. Okay, have a quick look at the packaging. It's got that black and bronze shine coating to this. The mission logo there, 24 gram steel tip. He's named down the side here, nice open window. So you can see the barrel, stem and flights. Michel will go down the bottom as well. On the back, he's got his nickname, the Sniper, Connor Scott. A little information about Mission Darts. What's inside? He's got the Mission Grip lock shafts, S lock rings, and 100 micron flights. And these are 0.05 grams of match weighted, so let's open this up. And again, from Mission Darts, what you get is that plastic with a fill insert. Got your mission point protector there, your three barrels, the short black sabre stems and the flights there as well. So let's have a close look at the barrel. Okay, having a quick look at the dark, it's got that bronze PVD silica coating on this, uh, just on that barrel there. So it comes with your black tip point, 26mm. It's got a, a bit of a lip right at the front here and it's got that long tapered smooth nose section here before it scalps in with that micro ring cut just in this section here and then it opens up again and tapers down ever so slightly with the mission logo etched on to that as well comes with your black short stem and the mission sniper flight there in the black and bronze uh, just to keep with the theme so the length of this is 48.5 millimeters and the width is 7.6 millimeters so i assume that section there is 7.6 millimeters because that looks like the thickest part of the barrel there so these are the 24 grams it also comes in 22 grams so for grip obviously that is just a smooth there but of course it's got that bronze silica coating on it you can, you can almost got like a texture feel to it so it's not a, a slippy slip you can once it warms up i think you'll you'll get the, the feeling of it so i'll give it a one just because of the, the coating that's on this, it's gave it that scallop section, a good steady three, uh, it's good comfortable grip to it. And obviously at the rear there, it's just the same as the one, uh, the front, so I'll give that a, a slight one. So I, I think it's really designed for people who's going to hold this section there, obviously, just for the grip wise. But again, he who knows, knows nothing, which is me. So it depends where you want to grip in it. There's one, three, and one um, just on that section there. Just because it's got that. I can you can feel the silicon coating on that. So I think once it warms up, yeah, it's not smooth. It is smooth, but you know, it's you can hold it definitely. So that's that there, guys. Just a nice simple micro ring cut the scalp section. And a long tapered nose. There you go. Right, so without waiting for the guys, let's have a few throws at the board. Okay, so what we'll do is have 9 and 12 throws of these. I will be holding the dart just like so. My thumb and forefinger just in that scallop section there. Um, hopefully, I can get enough push uh, with this dart. So, game on. Nice steady 60. Yeah, definitely if you're holding in that scalp area, I think that's where the benefit is with these. Um, that I've been holding, gripping the, the darts in my hand. I can feel the texture on that. Once that barrel warms up, there is a slight texture feeling on that. So depending on where you're holding this, uh, you do have slight form of gripping it. I think it's just because of that silica coating on it as well. But anyway, we'll keep going.
Okay, so the machine darts, the Connor Scots V2, 24 grams, a steely tip with that bronze silica coating on it. Um, not a bad dart. If you can hold that scallop section area with a micro ring cut, I think these will work easily for you. Um, front and rear, not so much unless you don't mind a really smooth dart. Uh, but that silicon grip thing, I mean, once it warms up, the barrel warms up, it seems to change the texture of that coating on it. So it does give it a slight bit more feel to that barrel. So yeah, these were easy to throw with. I did like it. I, again, that thumb, that scalp section with your thumb and forefinger is just where it's made to sit. And it just makes it easy to throw towards the board. Um, but apart from that, yeah, really nice and I do like that bronze coating on it as well. So these cost $49.95, I'll leave a link in the description box where you can purchase these. Don't forget to check out Mission's other products that came off the latest part one launch as well. Don't forget to check out the Stephen Burton dart that I've just done the review for the last Mission darts as well. I'd also like to thank Mission for sending these out to me to review on their behalf, so thank you to Mission darts. And that's it from me guys, hope you like the video, don't forget to click that like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already, turn on notifications for more reviews and live streams, and I'll catch you in the next one. Happy luck guys, bye.